Happy Sunday, everyone. Uh, welcome to, you know, kind of a different stream tonight, or today. Uh, I do have, you know, re NFL Red Zone, because uh, NFL is back now in the background. So, you know, for those who are, you know, keeping track of your fantasy uh, football teams, I can probably provide some updates. Uh, today, I'm, tr I'm playing Modern. I posted this Friday night that I... Um, Got a recommended list from uh, Andrea Mangucci. Shout out to him for uh, for letting me borrow these cards. Uh, and good luck to him. I know he had, well, I, I guess the event is already over, but he is playing in the uh, Four Seasons Legacy event. Uh, so I, don't, I think that is, I'm not sure if that's still ongoing. Probably is in the top eight at the moment. But um, I, w I do want to tr play something different, which is like uh, diversify... What I play on 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 MTGO and on stream, so um, this was a pretty solid list. I think the two losses might have been different if I drew uh, you know either the sideboard Blood Moon or Dress Down against the Saga decks or the grindy Saga decks that I played, which is where Jund and uh, and Boros. But otherwise, it felt very good against Combo, which I like. So we'll just you know run right into it. I had my sideboard guide that I got from him. And we'll go ahead and see how this goes. I think the deck is good though. Also, I think the legacy challenge is still going on too. So, uh, you know, hopefully we have some uh, elf players who are doing well. Or cradle control, whatever you want to call it. I know there is a... Uh, I look, actually I'll bring it up. This is pretty cool, I thought. Um, I looked earlier at the leagues and the cool thing is, so, oops, I guess well, what is the defining card in L's at the moment? I guess, Visionary. So it's pretty cool, right? We saw two elf lists uh, with enough cards different between them now that get posted in the 5 0 dump. So that I definitely uh, can appreciate. <laughs> Thank you, Bookish Man. I appreciate that. That's a very nice compliment. But yeah, I, uh, I definitely want to. You know, try some different decks. Um, I mentioned on the Dark Depths podcast, uh, again, yeah, it is. So that, that's the kind of the good thing. I am not, you know, completely new to playing Delver. Uh, so this is, like, for me, pretty straightforward. Uh, obviously, I'm not as familiar with the um, modern metagame, but from my play style perspective, uh, at least it's, I think, somewhat um, similar to Delver, and that's something I have experienced with in the past. A little bit floody here, but we have the Fire Islet, so it's okay. Um, and then, you know, this, it's pretty cool, right? I, I didn't play Modern for over a year and a half. <laughs> I didn't play Modern for over a year and a half, and then um, obviously I haven't seen Ragavan in quite some time, so it's kind of cool to see uh, the card again. Obviously different. I, I know it, some people are, you know, scarred by this in Legacy, so... Uh, I apologize for any uh, PTSD that goes on. Um, I think we leave with that. And the reason being is we can't attack anyways. If they want to kill it, that's fine. So this must be the new co combo goblins build with um, Horde Master. Well, that's quite annoying. Mm. I think we just play this bar and keep counter spell up. There's really no need to do anything like that right now.
I did play one league with this already uh, on Friday, and I went 3-2. I went 2-0 in all of those wins, uh, namely... Uh, I did not run into these really grindy Saga decks, and I felt like those matches were kind of easy. I even beat Living End after the resolve Living End, so that was kind of cool. Uh, might be Harbinger? Yeah, okay. Oh, oh. I am messing up. I needed a counterspell that, and I just like brain farted for a second. Oh, actually, it didn't really matter, right? Because they have a, a cavern out. Yeah, so I, again, not used to playing... Not used to... Um, what's the word I'm looking for? Play against cavern in, in quite a while. So that, that was just a misplay by me. I probably should have just played the DRC. I don't think it would have mattered here, to be frank. Um... Yeah, I don't think it would have mattered to be frank, but what we can do here, this is like, I feel like, I feel like I'm playing against DNT again in Legacy, right? Yeah, I think we might have to, right? Like, I think that's probably correct. Uh, I'll go ahead and fetch. Um, now I'm going to pop, I'm going to play the DRC. Uh, they probably kill it with the Fnatic, but there's nothing really I can do about it, right? Uh, this is good. This is like quite problematic for us. I think we probably lost this game one. I think we just do it just to feel the yard, right? Like, it feels so bad, but it is what it is. This this matchup is probably a nightmare, B based on uh, how this is planned panned out so far, so to speak. Uh, I feel like we just block because why not? It's a combo piece, right? Potentially die to it later on. Uh, Spell Pierce is dead. Um, I think I'm going to do this. And then just pop. Yeah. I mean, it feels bad, but like, what can you do? I have been on the other side of this many a times, and... Uh, I'm getting a little bit of my own punishment. Uh, being, I, I play like DNT and Legacy, and just like, I don't care about your counter spells with either ball, right? And occasionally in the past, uh, you know, like a one of counter souls or something. It might be time to just pack it in though. This is, uh, we can board out all our uh, permission. Th this matchup, uh, well, maybe not the matchup, but. Our hand did not line up well with their hand, and uh, it shows. Uh, well, we can take a look and see. I don't think it's going to matter. Um, we'll put the consider in our hand, exile that. I should I should have done this. I should have did that first in case we drew a DRC. We can like pitch to the bobble. Uh, yes. Didn't matter. We wanted to do that. It's not gonna matter. We're we're pretty behind. And they have a lot of card advantage. All right. Um. Well, that's just the kill, right? Well, that's even better. 
So, uh, if Kiki's on the board, alright, there we go. We'll continue. It didn't. I guess we can heat the. Um, we probably should heat the. Uh, so uh, again, I'm really really rusty at the moment. We should probably heat the Snoop, and then. But the problem is we're pretty behind anyways. I don't. I don't think it matters. Yeah, like right. See, they can kill our DRC. Well, maybe not. I think they probably just run everything in. To be honest, we're pretty bad. All right, uh, gotta play a little bit better. D that was not uh, a good showing for me there. Could kill Snoop, but uh, OP board was good anyways. Yeah, for sure, Lumberjacks. Um, definitely played very loose there, but uh, I think I was gonna be dead regardless. I'm, I'm extrapolating a little bit. I think we want the EEs for sure. Um, dress down, probably pretty good against them. I would imagine. Uh, I don't think I like any of the other stuff. Uh, we gotta bring in two more cards. A Blood Moon? Probably not against a Goblin deck. Um, I can see an Abraid as another removal spell. And I don't love Permission. Um... I guess maybe on hearse. It doesn't feel good though. Uh, maybe one counter spell. Like I, I don't really love any of the other options. Well, Blood Moon might just take them off. Uh, might steal game and take them off. Uh, where's hearse? I'm supposed to board something else here. All right. Yeah, Blood Moon might just take a game, but it's just cause like it'll keep them off Bogger maybe. But I don't love it. Um, this is fine. All right, we'll play attempt to play better here. That was definitely on me that first game. I think we would have lost anyways for what it's worth. But like I said, gotta play better. Yeah, so Josh actually mentioned it earlier. I, I'm basically a trader right now, but uh, it's good to know thy enemy, right? Kill the channel. That is fine. Um, I think here we just run out the. I think we run out the shredder and see what they do. I think next turn we want an iteration. So they're like tapping mana kind of strangely here. They sh what do they show? Wait, what? Oh, I see what they did. All right. Uh, I think. Here, yeah, we will iteration. Ooh. Alright, that's annoying. Uh, I think the moon doesn't do anything anymore. The Archmage's Charm is probably the best card. Uh, we'll put that away. And then, we'll oh, I should have exiled the Ragavan. That was a mistake.
We could actually we could have just played two sh a shredder and a ragavan. That that might have been just a bit better. Instead of iteration there, and just like get our clock going. Yeah, I, I feel like that was a mistake. We'll we'll remedy that right now. Like I for some reason I just wanted a tunnel vision into into uh, iteration. Um, but. All right, we'll do it correctly. Yeah. I think we can put away the arc mage just fine. Actually, we're just dead. What am I doing? Yeah, I'm like, maybe I should turn off the TV. <laughs> I can't focus right now. I should be, they, they have lethal on board, right? With the bogger, and now I'm just dead. All right, we are dead. That is my fault. I think what I should have done was the previous turn just like dig and then we just couldn't find removal is the problem, right? Uh, thank you for the follow, uh, triple AA. Uh, actually, I think the iteration play might have been okay, but we just didn't find removal. That's part of the problem, right? Uh, I think we needed to, we didn't have a second iteration, so I think in hindsight it probably wouldn't matter. Keep. All right, uh, again, we did not play the best, but I think we want to, oops, okay, I am not really playing well right now. <laughs> I am very, playing very poorly right now. Uh, no. Not punished. Thank good for it. Murfo. Right. Uh, we can play this. I think. Yes. Uh, do we? I don't think we care about their silly Murfolk. And then. Again, I am like playing really loose. Yeah, I know, Abaku. I'm, like, playing really poorly right now. I'm playing real poorly right now. Like, I didn't even get the Shredder trigger because I, like, misplayed. Alright, we, we gotta clean things up. We gotta clean things up. Uh, I think here we want to go DRC into Heat the, uh, the, what's it called? The... Uh, Merfolk, so that we can double trigger the DRC, and I think here we want to probably uh, we want to stack it so that the Shredder is first. Uh, I think we can pitch Pierce. Uh, I th think we probably don't want that. Put on the graveyard. Technically could have held a Pierce, but but I feel like the counter spell might be better. I don't even know what this does. Uh, 
Oh, sure. There's nothing, I guess, right now. Wait, what is the kicker then? Oh, I see. Uh, we can Merc Tide right now. Um, problem is, then we don't have Counter Spell up. Actually, let's do iteration. Um, we'll put this in hand. Uh, exile that, play the consider. We want to play the consider right now. Uh, I think we can put the Merc Tide in the yard and then draw. Mm, no, I think we want to land. Guess we can play the DRC into iteration, but we don't have counter spell up. But I think we just want to play it kind of very combo y. Uh, I think here I surveil first. No, I think. I think I want to surveil second. Uh, I think we want counters. I think we want to pitch the Merc Tide. There's no point at this point. Uh, let's put that in the graveyard. Sure. That's right, they do have their own counter spells. Uh, I guess this is a force attack. Let me trade here. I think that's fine. Uh, we have five power and lethal on board. Yeah, I'm not gonna attack. Sure. So question is, can they get deal with are two flyers. Like, what do they have? Alright, they punted. They they had the blast zone too for our DRC and just like punted. Uh, better lucky than good. So, I think EE here on two is probably pretty solid. Um, they have like a million lords. Uh, dress down might be interesting too. I wonder how Dress Down interacts with that one, uh, let's call it, that one creature. Might be a blowout though. Uh, Subtlety, I don't think I want. I don't think I want Spell Pierce either. Um, Moon, 
Probably not. Although I could just screw them. Uh, counter spell, I don't think I want against this camera souls kind of deck. I think we kind of board the same way as we did against goblins. Uh, pretty good hand. <laughs> hey Tim, how's it going? I love that you're liking elves and nice 5-0 last night. Uh, really appreciate you tagging me and giving me this shout out. Uh, I do think, yeah, I think if you, I think given that you play, have a background in lands and I like to kind of, you know, control the board state, I like to joke that elves is, you know, secretly, uh, what's it called? Like, cradle control, right? Uh, so I, I figured it makes sense that you would like the deck. So that, that does make sense. And obviously a good player can 5-0 like yourself. So, so for those that don't know, I'll, I'll retweet it right now. I'm going to F6 here. But where is it? Obviously, I need to work on my multitasking. But uh, all right, here we go. So here's my retweet of Tim's uh, 5-0 from last night. Uh, I think the play here is we can we're gonna bash and they, they flash something in. We can unholy heat it. Uh, otherwise, I think it makes sense to uh, be mana efficient here and just play the shredder. Yeah, Thoughtseize is very good, uh, for sure, uh, Tim. I think that's why, actually, out of the um, the non-blue decks, Elves, out of, aside from Moon, I guess, or some of these Chalice decks, I think Elves, aside from Delver and these Chalice decks, probably has the best combo matchup because of Thoughtseize. Alright, that's pretty annoying, but I think it's something we can deal with. Uh, I feel like there's a Flash creature coming my way. Oh, we can moon them here. That's kind of good. I think we're play this untap. Yes. Uh, we're gonna untack first and see what they do. Uh, so the question here is, do we uh commit the blood moon in three mana, which is probably permission? Uh, I think the safer bet is just to play the uh, the shredder. Alright, uh, I think here, counter target non unless this control pays one. Uh, we could just like hit this right now when it matters. I think we probably do. Well, actually, no, we can't waste their mana, I think, uh, next turn. So that's fine. Actually, we get, oh, I'm, that's bad. I lose the trigger from the shredder. So again, misplaying. I need to, I need to get better at that. Mm. I think we just do it now. We lose the shredder activation, obviously, but uh, I think put graveyard. All right, so they still have the um, whatever up, permission up. I think we just bash. I don't think we actually care if our thing dies. We'll see what they do.
And then we just pass. Mm. I think since they're tapped out, we probably just want to do it now. We just like bolt their thing and then. How do they counter it? Uh, no, I guess. Uh, I think this can be on top. So they have two cards now. If they tap out, we're just going to slam the Blood Moon. I think we do that now. Wow, they have a f fourth one? Uh, I think we... Graveyard. Sure, I don't think that matters. They should not play the island. Uh, our opponent is misplaying worse than us. Wow, that was pretty clean. I think, uh, ooh, that's all good. on top of the library. Sure. So our clock is faster than theirs. Uh, I think we should be okay, like despite my misplays. Uh oh, that cannot be good. Oh, okay. Uh, we do not have. Ooh, the EE -E is pretty good. The Bolt is like super good here. Put one into your hand. I think we put the EE -E into our hand and then do it like that.
And I think we'll just do it now. So two lords and we're screwed here, uh, but hopefully that doesn't happen. Oh, this is the draw. Interesting. Think we want the DRC. Alright. Uh better lucky than good. I don't think I played the best, but we got the win. <sighs> Alright, what's going on? All right, uh, we'll run it back. But yeah, I don't think I played the best there, but luckily the deck is very good, so I, I don't need to. I'll go ahead and uh, while we're waiting, turn on the AC, it's kind of hot. One thing I did, I have liked about this deck in my, you know, seven matches so far with it, is it seems like it doesn't really mulligan, uh, which I tend to like decks that don't do that. Uh, here we go, Sparrow, who died. I feel like this is probably not a good matchup. That helps. Definitely helps. Question here is, do I block? Um, I feel like we don't. They probably have removal, and if they don't, we get we get a ramp with a ragavan, which was is gonna be relevant. All right. That's also we have the archmage ch charm as well. Uh, I think we do this. We go Shredder and then immediately grow it with the Bobble. We have an Eyelon out there. Lava Spike. Very interesting. We 
You can hold up Archmage's Charm, which I like. And they, they don't do anything. We just maybe take their guide. Two damage. Uh, how safe do I want to play? Actually, we can still do everything I want to do, I think. I want to bash here. And then we can hold counter spell up and lightning bolt up. I like that a lot, actually. That way we get the trigger of the shredder too. Like, you know, we're trying to play at least somewhat moderately, you know, correct. We're gonna get the trigger. Another land. We're gonna bolt the guide. Hold up counter spell. Alright, we're playing a little bit better already. I think here we can just probably bin the land. And just like hold up a million per permission now. So they're gonna play idol on here. We're gonna arc mages charm that. And then we're gonna trigger our uh, shredder too. I think they might be conceding. We're like way ahead. Uh, I don't think we want the other shredder. The ragavan might be useful. Uh, put that into the graveyard. No, I think I want to keep the consider. And just hold up Archmage Charm. Jameis Winston scored a touchdown for me, though. But I think he's hurt now, so that's not good. Komet hasn't done anything. I think the only way we lose here is just, like, we get careless. I think if we... You know, keep Archmage's Charm up. There's no way to lose, right? Uh, Searing Blaze, one to one. Uh, do we actually care? So the problem, the thing is, I think we actually stopped that. Uh, because this actually changes the clock, right? Uh, 
Uh, in case we iteration here. Yes. Okay. Just spoken like a uh, person who knows what's going on. Discard a card. Discard that. I'm gonna put this into our hand and then cast this potentially. There's another EI, but I think I'm just gonna do that. I don't think they have like anything crazy like Blast Zone. Um, Is there a reason to not put up heat? I think I think we just do it now. Like just present lethal on board, like regardless of what they do, right? Yeah. All right. Um. Is Okay, I have a cyborg map for this. Uh, against burn, okay. Plus three flush storm according to Andrea. And minus two iteration, minus archmage charm. That makes a lot of sense because it's slow. All right. Uh, and then I think that's all he does, which is reasonable. Something I realized too is uh, forcing me to play some of these other decks. You know, I had gone used to uh, playing a lot of elves, you know, the last two years during the pandemic because uh, <laughs> uh, oof, I don't think I can keep this. Uh, it doesn't do anything. Turn one. I think we keep, but I don't love it. Yeah, so, so the thing is, I think it makes me a better player, potentially. Mark Tire, that's not good. Uh, I feel like I have to maybe run out the Ragavan here. There's no wasteland, obviously, in modern, so I can play a little bit different. If counterspell effect, this is a uh, blue red murktite uh, in modern. I think we let that go. Ooh, that is nasty stuff. <laughs> uh, put Bobble into the graveyard, yes. Alright, there's the first blue source. Unfortunately, I cannot attack because of the Firewalker, which is very gross. All right, so they're pushing damage here. Essentially what's happening is... <laughs> what did I reveal? Oof. I'm probably dead. Uh, oof. I do not love my spot right now.
And I can't stop the bleeding too because of Core Firewalker. So I was mentioning Sadra that I think this makes me a better player overall. Just having more range. I think we're dead. I'm not gonna. Well, I guess we can see what else they could potentially hit at. That's like one useful thing before we concede. Rift ball. All right, we're like dead way beyond belief. We don't want them to see our sideboard cards too, so... Ooh, that was very brutal. Uh, we got stuck on lands, and I don't love Counterspell, to be honest, in this matchup. I feel like I want that Abrade. So I am going to adjust real quickly. Yeah, I don't think I love this card that much. I think the Abrade is probably better. Let's try that. Uh, keep. All right. Sure, they didn't do anything, so I guess we can just consider and dig for a creature. Um, I feel like we want to keep that. No. Ooh, Shredder is even better. Um, so they have the Rip Bolt that's suspended. Um, I don't think I want to like expose the shredder, so I'll just do this. I just pass and hold up counter spell. Sure. Hmm. I might as well do it now. Because they might not have anything for me to counterspell, and I just waste mana. Sure, okay, that, that works, I guess. I can eat two from the steam vents, but I don't love that. Uh, I think the way it works here is I just want to ride like a few big threats and I think we can pitch the Ragavan. Sure. Uh, and then I'll play this tapped. I should have actually held the bobble because it doesn't change anything. And just in case they want to nuke my yard. Now I understand why they kept in. Sure. Now I understand. Hey, kind of magic, how's it going? I am in the danger zone here. So let's see, one, two, this would be three. It'd be a six, six. 
and then this would be a takes three to fourteen. Yeah, I think I do that. So they're at 12. Did I do that math wrong? I feel like I did. I might be dead. I think I pitched the upgrade. All right, I am in a lot of trouble. the heat in the yard, I guess. Got a clinch for a turn, I guess. I can't kill any of their creatures. Like, they haven't played any. Protection from red. Exile all cards are red from graveyards. Sure. So, I, let me see. I can heap. Well, actually, yeah, let's do this. It'll give me extra triggers. Actually, Jesus Christ, I did not get there. Did they whiff too? Oh, I think we got there. Wow, okay, we got lucky. Wow, okay, that was uh, pretty crazy on both sides. We whiffed and they whiffed. All right, we'll take it. Um, wasn't the best, but we'll take it. Like, we tried to dig for, to get turned on Delirium and then we just couldn't.
Two one. I think if we can go three two, that'll probably be good enough for me, right? Like from a just feeling good about this perspective. It's nice to be uh, you know out of your comfort zone every once in a while. See how my fantasy football team is doing. Uh, we are slight favorites at the moment. So Jameis is uh, doing decently. Our tight end hasn't done jack, but it's a whole different story. Uh, blue, no threats. I think we, it's like kind of dicey, but we'll keep, I guess. We'll, you know, try to dig for a creature. I don't even know what this does. Tap any... Jesus, alright. I have to deal with that. Thank you. Yes. Uh, do I heat that now? Probably, yeah. Because I need to kill something bigger later on. going on? What am I playing against? The greedy play here is the iteration for land, but if I miss, it's going to be a problem. I think we play it safe and heat this right now. This line leaves us spell pierce too, which is not bad. I think if we just get the chance, we're gonna pierce whatever they do. And then we hope, to t like with the Ragavan on board, I don't really want to, for them to just like develop the mana the way they would, right? All right, what's coming down here? Power conduit? This seems like something that I sh I don't, I'm not even gonna read it. It just seems like some kind of combo piece. Not that we care. Now we iteration. Um, ooh. We can't, the only thing we can cast here is the bolt. Um, and then I think we can just like merp tie them. Like, who knows like what, what what their deck is doing, right? I don't even know what read ahead is. Um, if we Murktai here, Counterspell is down. Tap any number, of untap artifacts. 
All right. Uh, I think we just play DRC here to be safe. And we'll, I, I don't want to be down counter spell here. Oh, okay. Thanks for explaining that, uh, Dustin. Uh, do we even care? Probably not. That's annoying. Uh, that's a lot of text. Probably. A yeah, I think that's a counterspell time. Like, we, the whole point was we, we want to leave a counterspell, right? And now... Like it's do do we with little bolt is the thing. We we definitely murkai though. Uh, and then I think we just leave a bolt. There's like really I could have actually just played the uh, the DRC, but there's really no choice, no need. And I should have actually exiled something else, so I keep delirium. I just like did it too hastily. Up to one target you can show Alright, so we can just bolt that. Blue red is good against picking apart these kind of like wombo combo decks that rely on synergy. Yeah, I don't I don't know what's going on, but like blue red legacy or modern is good against these kind of decks. And then my fault for, uh, oops. what's it called? It? Turning off my own delirium by being careless. I don't know if it's gonna matter, but yeah, I guess it didn't matter because they had the ball anyways. This might have done some damage. I don't know what this does, but so they get a four four flyer plus, you know, loot effect. I guess maybe it would have been fine even if I didn't counter it. Oh, this Browns game is pretty good. Shadow Sphere, all right. So even if, he, if they gain four here, I think I'll be okay. again sure oh, 
That's actually really annoying. I can do, I guess. Only stops really one damage. This is so awkward, like, God. I can't attack because I'm dead. Well, potentially. So if they have the removal spell, then I take nine, otherwise they Gain six, and I have them on the crackback. Wait, wait, wait. I'm, now I'm really. Oh, shoot. One, they gain five. This goes a six and then seven and then I'm dead. Yeah, I can't. I should I should do it on myself and then fetch potentially. Fable is a problem though. I should have done it myself and then potentially fetch. Oh, heat is real good here. Actually, I, yeah, that's pretty good here. Oh shoot, I like messed up. I realized that delirium is going to cost me now. Oh, that's annoying. <sighs> that's what I get for getting sloppy. I wonder if they have a removal. <sighs> if they have a bolt, I think we're dead. They have two already. I think we can... They gain five. I think we play to win. The guys shrink when you kill one, yeah, that's for sure. That is quite annoying.
I should... Ugh, I keep messing up. Like, I'm not playing very well. I should heat the... Okay, that's fine, I think. I'm really confused what's going on. How did they just make another to- What is going on? Shouldn't they be going to chapter two? No, now I'm really confused. Oh, I think they removed it from the fable. Okay, that's... Okay, now... I like threw this game big time. Oh man, I threw this game. Yeah, I cannot believe I'm losing to this. Yeah, I okay, I see what's going on now. That is something else. Alright, um should not have lost this game, but that's my that's on me. Um I think we want the dress down. I think, I don't, I don't even think I've seen, I think we want the Blood Moon for sure. Probably the Abrade, and then, may, I don't know if the EE is worth it or not, but Permission seems pretty good here. Um, I don't know if I want Un Unholy Heat. Pierce? Hex Parasite is one mana. I could steal it. I feel like that's kind of narrow for the Archmage's channel when we're boarding in Blood Moon. Fluster, probably not. Uh... Yeah, I think Bolt could be useful to just close out. So we'll try that. Definitely on me though, I threw that game. Did not, um... Cause essentially what happens is, I could have heated the, uh... The big construct. If I didn't, if I had delirium, and that that life link that they would have had would have not mattered. So that that's I th on me, like for you know being too hasty. Uh, they would play that and pass. They don't do any relevant. We just consider on their turn. If it is relevant, we just upgrade or counterspell it. Sure. Uh, I th 
think we put the bobble in the hand, land, and then the bobble. Uh, I think in this case, we just bobble now in case we drop, you know, spell pierce or something. in the yard or not yes oh that is a hell of a draw it's too bad though that we have the um we can moon them right now and then they're down a land i think i kind of like that i think might as well I don't think we just don't slam the moon right now. Yeah. It's a stone rain. The goblin token, you know. Sure. I think we go double DRC. Well, we probably let's see. I wonder if we have to um, deal with the Ragamant. Maybe actually we have blockers. It's fine. Yard. Uh, I think that's okay. They have the relic too, which can shrink our DRCs. I think we can consider now and then draw into the bolt. Uh, on top of library. I think we can assign blocks and see what they do. Sure. to the graveyard. I should have not blocked. I should have done it the other way. I'm like getting really sloppy because it's only two here.
Yeah, I. God, I'm, why am I? I'm playing so poorly right now. <sighs> yeah, again, I thought that was main phase, um, but it is what it is. They're gonna have another favor. I think I will lose this match. And that's on me. Could not overcome all that poor play. I may just lose to these two twos, like creating uh, tokens every turn now. And then the fable is a problem too, right? That, this game or this match was definitely on me though. I. Did not play nearly close to acceptable. Jesus. Pretty cool deck from our opponent, though. And I can't tell if, like, we just didn't play very well or they just or their deck's just good right like maybe both but we we didn't do ourselves any favors that's for sure i think they have lethal right like why yeah all right that doesn't all right cool. interesting line from our opponent Wow, this is overtime, and uh, it looks like Pittsburgh kicking for the win. They were up big, and then uh, they they threw the lead. I picked for my survivor of Cincinnati, so I could be just out after week one, so this is kind of funny. Uh, looks like it is no good. Wow. Off the goalpost, wow, pretty crazy. Uh, all right, so here, got a mulligan, no lands. Uh, I think we keep, but it's not great. There's no threat. Uh, I think we can put the Archmage's Charm back. It's like very mana intensive. Oh my god, we're playing against goblins. I think we look at our top and see what, what that is. Bolt, uh, okay. And then... I think we're gonna fetch just in case. We don't wanna draw the ball. Playing better, at least there, right? Instead of the running, because we can check before we commit what we wanna do. Here, consider, we just like bin, yes. More lands. I think the line here is 
it would just hold a counter spell, I think. Uh, there is a chance we want to fetch first. Actually, yeah, I think we want to fetch the thin. The cavern here, we're like... DRC, uh, probably not. Two, yes. Nope. I should, uh, oh, I should have fetched. Not. Pretty good with Pasha Lake Mons. All right, we're gonna fetch now. No. Fl flooding a little bit for sure. We take two here. Thirteen. I think we're dead. That's a lot of damage. Uh, then we have the iteration here and hope. The Arc Mage's charm is not probably not good enough. Uh. We can consider for a removal spell, but I don't even think that matters, right? Like, one, two, three, four, five, six damage. Uh, they can just, like, kill all of them. I think we have to dig for removal on the Sling Gang now. So put one in your hand and play the other one. Uh, it's probably... Put this in hand, exile that, play the consider. Consider right now. Yes. Ugh, that's not getting it done. The problem is everything's double, right? It's like four, and then it's like a ton of damage.
Jesus. All right. This matchup feels hard, but it's hard to say. Like, permission being down hurts a lot. Uh, I think that's fine. Uh, I think we'll keep this. It's better than the hand that we had last game. Yeah, for sure, uh, Corridor. It's just like, our hand didn't line up very well against theirs. Actually, what am I doing? Like, I should've saved the fetch, but then, like, I should've... I'm not playing very well right now. Like, I'm seeing things I'm not supposed to be seeing. Uh, they probably they should pop the, the thing right now. Um, this is very awkward. Yeah, I I think so too. Like, like we lost two life here for no reason because I like didn't play the spar bluff canal. Why does this keep happening? I think I want to, since I can't play anything here, I think I just want to exile the um, Ragavan. And then, because Ragavan is not going to be able to connect, uh, just like in Legacy, right? Um, I feel like the EE is probably what I want. And then the dress down is not, is okay, I think. And then I'm gonna exile that because I have no mana. Maybe the correct play should have been to. Um, it's hard to say, but I might have. It might have been correct to play the island there, so I can cast the the ragavan or something. I think here, um, I think I'm going to consider, yes, uh, into heat, into, uh, Grow a Murtide. And then go all in on the Murtide. Hopefully they don't have the Sting Scourger, as mentioned. Or Terminate. Might be the Sting Scourger, we'll see. Yep. Alright, um, unfortunate, but what can you do? Oh, 
Oh, we have a counter spell. Okay, that's pretty sick. Oh, unfortunately, the cavern is annoying. Yeah, they're smart, they'll cavern it, but I feel like they will do it. I don't think I care about that card. View sideboard. Sure. Uh, two. You unusable cards, unfortunately. Uh, there's no reason I think to pop the EE right now. Like, their their mana type is uh, varied. I guess I can see what's on coming from me. E I, okay. I think because I'm an iter iteration next turn, I might as well. Oh man, it's so small. The the Merc Tide is it like even worth it? Jesus Christ. I guess I play the island. I guess I put the island in my hand in case I need to pitch the shredder. Uh, put that and then play this. And then I'll consider first in case it matters. That, that's not doing anything right now. Well, it could be a draw to One, two, three, four, five. Might need the actual just raw card advantage. No. And then maybe I feel so bad if I E right now. I probably should have played the Steam Vets to be honest. I should I should do this. Okay. Yeah, I should have played the steam vents in case it matters. They're gonna cavern something through. Oh my god. It's a lot of damage. 
I might have to... Ugh. Two, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Might have to save some damage here. Feels very bad, but. Yeah, yeah, for sure, for sure. Am I gonna stabilize? Oh my god. Jesus. I don't think I can stop what they're doing. Like I can't. I feel like this matchup is very bad. Like I didn't. I know I didn't play the best, but it does not feel. I mean, maybe also because they happen to have the answer for the Merc Tide. Uh, I got to draw two now and hope. E E. I don't even think that matters because. They can't stop the sling gang, right? Like, uh, this is gonna get there, probably not. Put into graveyard. Oh, I screwed up. I should have waited for the. Okay, they paid the echo, so it didn't matter. Actually, I'm one short, so it didn't matter. Because I can kill the sling gang here. But they can just kill in response, right? Alright. Uh, not my day for modern. Went two and three. I lost the goblins twice. I lost two, I lost the red decks, I guess, right? And a saga deck. Two, two goblin decks and a saga deck. I think the deck is fine, but maybe it has a weakness. Uh, I know I didn't play the best, but it did definitely feel like I, it, the Goblins matchup is very difficult. Um, I'll bring it up again. Uh, maybe we need some sweepers in the sideboard because it, it just did not feel like I was in those games against the Goblins player. Um, and then against the Artifact deck, I think I might have thrown game one. And then game two, it's hard to say. My opponent played pretty well to their credit. Um, but yeah, we lost the two goblin decks, so maybe that's something to address. Um, I think for now I'm probably good. Uh, let's see who's, you know, who's playing, and then we can raid. 
Since we're, uh, we played modern today, I will go ahead and raid a modern player. Uh, let's try Trellin Moto. Alright, uh, sorry, I apologize, I did not play the best, but I think, like I said, the two go the matches were probably pretty hard too. Um, and w I did have fun at least, I enjoyed the deck and, you know, learning the play styles. Uh, very similar to Delver. I definitely needed to clean up some of the sequencing because I, like, lost out on, uh, on, like, Shredder triggers as a result, right? Like, Shredder's a card I hadn't played with before, but, you know, no excuses, just explanation. But... No, nevertheless, I had fun uh, playing this. Um, so let's go ahead and raid. Actually, here, I put my socials up again if you want to see the elves content. I think the next stream I do will probably be elves again. I just wanted to play something fun uh, for today. Um, did hurt my rating, unfortunately, which I was pretty high prior to this because I've been running hot with elves. But, you know, uh, we aim to learn, right? So let's go ahead and raid. Uh, it looks like Trellin Magic MTGO. Uh, and thank you for uh, coming by today. 